Yo, what's going on? It's D-Man, bringing to you some more Jump Force gameplay. Today we have Frieza, but I'm doing Awakening, so I will be using Golden Frieza. And I can't wait to do that. I know he's going to look clean. I know a few people have been asking, you know, how do I play this beta? Well, what I do is I play the beta when it goes live, and then I record a lot. And then after that, I just, I post what I have. So right now the beta is on like 100, 100 hiatus. But when it comes back, just know I have more gameplay. You already know that. But I hope you all enjoy this video. It was kind of live. Freezer, let me see what you're working with. Ooh. That golden freezer is kind of clean. All the awakenings are clean, but it's something. It's something about the golden freezer. You see my boy shining? You see him? Man, look. It's funny because when it comes to like Dragon Ball games, I never use Frieza, no matter what it is. Even in the first Xenoverse, I never use Frieza moves. I don't like Frieza as a character. But this golden, that shine on him, it's kind of cold. He's a beast too. There we go, Death Beam. I think Frieza is like a beginning character in any Dragon Ball game, bro. Any Dragon Ball game, if you're struggling, pick Frieza. In Xenoverse case, if you're struggling, you can use his moves. Like, Frieza is just easy and cheese all around, bro. I wonder if he'll be the same in Jump Force. We caught him with the grab. There we go. Send him flying. Chase him down. I'm getting nice at that chase. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, when the beta goes live, all I do is just practice. That's all I do is practice. So I'm getting that chase down and all that stuff. What I really want to work on is the stage transition. Because once I get that down, it's going to be a wrap. Uh-oh. Let me watch out for Ichigo. As a matter of fact, I have to use Ichigo because I know he has an awakening. They talk a lot about Ichigo and Jump Force and Jump Force adding a final version of him from the manga. So we'll see. Huh, Frieza is tough. Frieza is tough. I'm not going to lie to you. I didn't want to say it because I don't like him. It's like everybody I don't like in their show, I like him on Jump Force. Caught him. I don't like Vegeta like that, but he's tough on here. I don't like Frieza at all, but he's tough. Those discs coming back. Caught him. Hold on, Frieza. We might have to run it back. Let me run it back with Frieza because that was a little bit too cool. You see the glisten? You see him? Like that, that awakening is crazy. Round two, Frieza, go golden again. Hello? Oh, he has the 100%. So Frieza, so what? I wonder what determines him going 100% and him going golden. I think that's tough though. I like that a lot, bro. I like it a lot. I don't like this form, but I like it a lot that he has both on Jump Force. Well, I guess we're 100% with it. Kenshin is still about to get the work though. Still get in the hands. Caught you. I'm ready for this game to come out, man. I'm having too much fun. I wonder what the story mode is going to be like. Like, my one issue with anime games and story modes now, it's like they're all the same. Like, what's going on with that? When it comes to Xenoverse 2, Dragon Ball Fighters, even Jump Force, it's like something is going on in the timeline. The timeline has been altered. Of course, we know that because Future Trunks is everywhere. But the thing is, like, every anime game has evil clones now. I see the Jump Force trailer, and I'm like, man, we're doing that again? Future Trunks, you're back again? Like, golly. But we'll see how it is, man. Ooh, Genshin just turned up. We'll see how it is, though. Either way, the roster is still going to be impressive. But it comes with the end game. Like, I wish these anime games had more longevity. You beat these anime games and it's just, they're done within two or three weeks. Every single time. Outside of like Xenoverse 2, they kept that going for a while. And Storm, the community kept Storm alive for a pretty long time, but those are really the only two. But we'll see, man, we'll see. There we go. You can have those discs. I have two. Oh, I tried to block, he grabbed me. And the disc went right through him. All good. There we go. Caught you. Once I get used to this combat, it's gonna be a wrap. It's gonna be a wrap. Nope. 
Oh, guard break? Okay. Then he grab? I forgot the AI is a little bit smarter on this build. You just can't block. They're going to grab you every time. Every single time. Let me just get him out really quick. I want to hit that stage transition, but I don't think it's going to happen. I don't think it's going to happen. Caught him? Caught him again? Nope. Oh, well. Oh, what? Wait, so he can still go golden after 100%? I did not know that, bro. This whole time, I could have been golden. This whole time. Yo, Frieza, he's dope because he has two awakenings. So, that's kind of live, man. That's kind of live. I'm not going to lie to you. Man, I have to see who else has dope awakenings.